Welcome back and um, welcome to my bout of books wrap up video. Um, if you're following along on the blog I was doing my daily updates but I didn't post one for Saturday or Sunday because I didn't do any reading on Saturday which was day six and Sunday would have been my wrap up post anyway which was when I kind of finished off. So if you want to know more detail about the books or what the books look like or anything like that because everything was either audiobook or ebook that I read um, you can click onto my blog the blog post will be up on Thursday. So I started off by reading or listening to Dash and Lily's Book of Dares by Rachel Kern and David Leverton. Um, I, this has been on my wish list for a long time. Um, so I borrowed it from the library, listened to it in basically one sitting, um, loved it. So that was 260 pages. Uh, then I also finished off Heartbreaks and Milkshakes at the Starlight Diner and Secrets and Fries at the Starlight Diner. Um, I read both of these because I'm going to be on the blog tour for Secrets and Fries at the Starlight Diner this Saturday. Um, so look out for the review of both of those and a special guest post from Helen Cox. Uh, Secrets and Fries and Starlight Diner were 243 pages and 270 pages. Uh, then I also listened to the audiobook of Aristotle and Dante, <coughs> excuse me, Discover the Secrets of the Universe. Um, again, this was one that had been on my wish list for a long time and so got this from the library as well. Was loving Overdrive this week. Um, this was 359 pages and then another audiobook that's been on my wish list for a while. This is the great thing about readathons, you get the chance to like read books that you've been wanting to read for ages because you've finally got an excuse that you have to read during a readathon. So you're picking up those books that are just kind of wallowing in the background for a little bit. Uh, the other book that I read was Mad Girl by Bryony Gordon, which was so entertaining. And again, pretty much read this from start to finish or listen to it all in one day and then I wanted to read the final five meet cute series books short stories by Katie Lovell um, but I only actually managed to read three just because I didn't do any reading on Saturday and I did very little reading on Monday so I didn't kind of get as much done as I wanted to <laughs> Oh, excuse me, but <laughs> hiccuping now. Uh, but I did manage to read The Boy with the Boxes, The Boy at the Barbecue, and The Boy on the Bus. Uh, so I've got two more of those left to read, which hopefully I'm going to read this week. Uh, so all together, I read five whole books, three short stories, and they total 1,512 pages. So I think that's a pretty good readathon. Uh, if I look back to this time last year and the bout of books at the beginning of this time, last year I don't think it'll have been successful um, so I really enjoyed this readathon I took part in the chat and I took part in some of the challenges and I've been doing some of the challenges on Instagram as well so it's been really good fun to kind of get involved in that way as well uh, so I really enjoyed this bout of books and as I say if you want to know more details about those books or you want to look at any of them the blog post is going to go through in the exact same way as I just read out there Okay, I will have another video for you soon, so I will see you then. Bye!